Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> oh, Lord, I hope this is... Hope, this is <laughs> Let me pause and we'll check it out and see if it's working. Okie dokie. Smokey. <laughs> we should be ready to go. Um, I couldn't wait. Um, I did get my Timu package in. It had a big tear in it, so I went ahead to open it. I, I only seen one thing so far, so <laughs> I just couldn't wait, y'all. Um, <laughs> so I hope you guys are doing well. Um, I'm pre-recording this because I couldn't wait to, uh, <clears throat> yeah, to open it. Um, so I will put it out on Tuesday, maybe if I can stand it to wait that long. Um, but, uh, I hope you all are doing well and having a good weekend and all that good stuff. And, um, brain fog <laughs> or brain fart, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, this is a towel and um, I got it on lightning deal it was eight something and um, I got it on a lightning deal for three dollars so I'm loving it y'all look at the sugar skulls I love thin towels um, a lot of times I use them for my hair look y'all isn't that cool <laughs> Um, does it say the size on there? I mean, it's pretty good size. Let's see. Ugh. Okay, let me see. Need these. Sorry, y'all. I've been working outside. Um, it is 70 by... 150 centimeters. I don't know why they can't put inches, but that's okay. That's pretty good size. So I'm excited about it. Um, if you remember right, uh, not too long ago, I got a little white one. I mean, no. <laughs> a little blue one that had like teddy bears and stuff on it. Um, I was going to give it to my granddaughters, but they left it here. And then... Um, I like this. This is pretty. Um, so I thought, okay, well, I'll use it as a hair towel. It's not a good hair towel, y'all. It does not soak up the um, water from my hair. So, yeah. There's the first thing, y'all. I love it. It's so bright. Pretty colors. Absolutely. Yay! So there's that. Reaching in. Still something else. What's this? What is this? It says brown. Oh! I know what it is. So this is for the winter. It um, goes on your head what's that for oh that's the cover <laughs> it goes up or down so it goes over your head when it's cold it goes you then you can put like your coat or whatever over it um it's it is pretty thin breathable um i don't know it's kind of made weird but that's okay. So these were like two or three dollars. And um, you put them on underneath your uh, jacket, head, you know, like that to help um, in the winter time. 
I probably, I think I got two of these. One, one for myself and one for my husband. I think. I think I got two. My idea was to get two. <laughs> Whether that happens or not, we shall see. So there's that. It has all these different... Um, what do they call these things? <laughs> I don't know what they're called. Okay, so there's that. What else we got? There's a box in here. What? I can get it. Get it out. What did I get that has a box? <laughs> I got me a pink one. <laughs> How cool is this? I'm so excited. Because I, I got that one for a gift. And then I thought, man, I want one of those because it's all sealed. And when I'm outside working with the chickens or whatever, I mean, you can open it too. But um, it has a sealed. It's that Stanley dupe or whatever. And I think I got this for um, $9. So, hey. And it's iridescent looking. You see that? Isn't that cool? But this is the peachy one. They called it pink, but I got a straw. Let's see. Eh. Let's see. <laughs> I ain't got to worry about bugs getting in my water when I'm outside with the, with the chickies. And all the animals. Yay! Sweet! I'm excited. This is so nice, y'all. It's 40 ounces. And plus, it helps with my hands. I wish... I tried to get a black one, but they didn't have any black ones. So, um, this has the handle on it. And, you know, like I said, sometimes I have this one. Um, it's 40 ounces also, but sometimes my hands are real weak. And, uh... It's easier to pick them up like this. But this one's taller and skinnier. And this one's rounder and fatter. <laughs> so, but they're both 40 ounces. Oh, yay. I'm so excited, y'all. I love it. We'll see how well. Now, I can add ice to this one. And it'll keep all day just about. So, I'm curious to see how well this one will keep ice. Okay, so there's that. Here, let's pick our trash up. I'm getting too excited. <laughs> getting too excited, y'all. Getting too excited. Okay, and oh, don't look. What's this? Oh, I got another one. I have to look at my receipt because I had it on my watch list. They've done this to me several times before. Maybe I could use this one as a Christmas gift. Yeah. <laughs> a Christmas gift. I know who. <laughs> I know who to give it to. Okay. So there's that. Uh, what's this? <gasps> Yay! My little containers. My little herb containers for our uh, picnic box for the car. Yay! I got the assorted colors because I figured I could put different seasonings in each one. Nice! Because, you know, I got the bigger one that I got for the bug out bag. And, um, excuse me, I put salt, pepper, garlic in it. Because that's like my go-to seasoning for everything. So I figured I could put different, you know, things in here. Or maybe, um, just... Yeah, I'm excited. These were, I don't remember how much these were. Maybe $2, possibly $2. But yeah, you get three of them, three little ones. 
See there? And they have good, uh, they got good holes. You know, sometimes you get them and they're tiny holes and you're sitting there and shaking and then it gets clogged up. And But these got good size, good size little holes. I'd probably say these are, what, maybe two ounces, maybe. But yeah, there's those for the picnic box. I'm excited about those. Okay, next. <laughs> I'm going through this. I'm so excited. What is this? What is this? Oh, okay. So I got some little carabiners. They're a lot smaller than I figured they would be. There's supposed to be five in here. They're very thin. I mean, I can hook stuff to my backpack with these. They lock open. I don't know. I mean, I guess they'll work. Yeah, they'll work. I got five of them. Come in a pack. Um, they might have been like a dollar... Dollar eighty-nine. They're aluminum. I thought they would be a little sturdier, but that's fine. They'll work for something so yeah see you get five of them i think they were like a dollar 99 or dollar 89 or something like that i'll link it all i'll link them in the description below and if you haven't and you like me <laughs> like share and comment <laughs> being a little silly i've been silly the last few days but that's fine okay here we go what's next What's this? Uh, that's all they sent? Are you kidding me? Well, I guess that's 10. Um, I got these from a bug out bag. They are... Um, I'll order some more. Because they're hard to find if you go to the store. So, I will order some more. But, they're band-aids. But what they're used for is um, closing an incision. So you see how they have a big part, small, big, and what you do is you stretch it. Like if you cut yourself real bad, you can stretch it over and it'll close the, the wound good. But they only sent me 10. I thought there was gonna be more than that. I don't remember how much they are. They weren't over a um, dollar, I don't think. Maybe. Uh, they might have been right under $2. That ain't a good deal if that's the case. But it is considering you can't really find them hardly. Or I can't. So, um, yeah, those go in the bug out bag. What is this? Oh, a tourniquet. Yeah. So I got this tourniquet for my bag. I meant to get two of them, but I only got one. Um, it's good because it has the, it has it all together. Um, and it's a large, so it could go around a large area if needed. Like so, you know, and then you, you put it around you push it through here, and then here is your... You know, I'm not quite sure how to do it. Maybe. Oh, okay. So, I'm guessing what you do is this. Okay, here's your little twist. This is what you want to twist whenever you're putting your tourniquet on. So how would you, Lordy B, this would be something that you would need to figure out beforehand. <laughs> so I'm not sure how that works. Um, how would that work? Oh, okay. Here's the thing. So you would, I put this like this through here. I'm guessing. And then 
Well, no, that would have to... Okay, so you're doing it like this, I guess. And then you're going to... Oh, that's in there. Right? Is it? It does. It cinches up. This runs, this right here, runs all the way through here. And then as you're spinning it, it's tightening around. Okay. I guess. And then you would pull it through here. You would pull this past this, like so. To hold the tourniquet on. I guess my hands aren't strong enough. <laughs> and then you Velcro this over like that. And then this would be the tourniquet that's right here is where your arm would be. Yeah, okay. I think I have to do some more research on that to find out if that's how that works. But I'm thinking that's how that works. Just to have, if you're out camping or, um, you know, out doing whatever, then you have something in case, you know, somebody gets hurt or, you know, like that. So, I mean, you can use anything as a tourniquet as long as you tie off, you know. Um, a lot of people carry an extra belt with them. That way they can, uh, you know, <clears throat> turn this back this way. And then this guy comes over here and you can put it in your bag all folded up. Now this, I think, was around maybe 6 or $7. But in my opinion, I mean, better safe than sorry. Because, you know, you never know when something's going to happen. And um, having something like that is, um, I bet it tells you in here how to do it. <laughs> Your girl is off a key, as usual. Let's see. Well, you can't even see the darn picture. You can't see the picture. It's so faded. Look at this. You can't see that hardly. It's so faded out. Yeah. But it tells you how to do it at least. Okay. It's like this got wet or something. <clears throat> okay. Put that back in there. Yeah, this is going in um, either the camping kit or the bug out bag. Probably the bug out bag. Um, now watch me not be able to get it back in here. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay. Awesome. That would keep it, you know, dry and clean. So there's that. What else? What's this? Ooh, what is this? Stainless steel three-piece suit. I don't see a suit fitting in here, but it might be a Christmas present. I don't know. I don't remember. It's heavy. Not real heavy, but it's heavy. So, let's see what TT is. It's got a cool little bag. Let's see. Oh! <laughs> okay. Check these out. Yeah, I got these for the bug out bag too for camping. Check it out. It's a fork. And it folds out. And then you bring that up and it locks it. Isn't that cool? Fold it back down. There's the fork. And then you get a spoon. I thought these were cool. You know, they're compact. Here's your spoon. 
slide this little thing down here like that and that keeps it in, in locked. So that's cool. And then you get a knife, a butter, like a butter knife. Look at that. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Those are neat. I love them. And they come with their own little case. These were like three or four bucks too. But I thought, hey, what the heck? You know, um, they're metal and yeah, okay. Well, those are cute. It has a little Velcro right here. And then it has a little thingy you could put on, use one of the carabiners. And either put it on the outside of your um, backpack. My fingers will work right. Yeah, see? Put it on the outside of your backpack. Hang it there like that. That way you're not taking up room on the inside of your bag. Okay. That's cool. <sighs> oh. <laughs> okay. These are um, elastic bands. For like an ace bandage. I think I got multiple sizes of these also. Smell like ew. But they're the old-fashioned kind. They got the little metal deal. Nowadays, if you get them, they either don't have nothing or they have like Velcro there. I much prefer these because, I mean, if need be, you could use one of these as a tourniquet too. So, yeah. Nice. So there's that one. I think there's more. I think I got two or three different sizes. I don't know. What's this? What's this? Oh, my ring. This is a size 10. Oh, how pretty. Oh, so we got the little ring. Is it going to focus? Probably not. There we go. It's a size 10. I got it for one of my bigger fingers. Let's see. Well, I don't know. I was hoping to be able to fit it like halfway or something. But I can switch it out. I can switch it out with one of these or something. But that's pretty. I don't know why it's not focusing. There we go. That's pretty. It looked a little different in the description. But that's okay. Because I thought that, okay, there is a dragonfly on it. Okay. Because I got it. I love dragonflies. And see. <laughs> but um, my granny always said. That if she came, was reincarnated, she'd come back as a dragonfly so she could eat every single fly on the face of the earth. <laughs> okay. That was like 80 cents. Okay. Here's another one. I'm not going to open it. But it's a little bigger. See? Best to always have multiple sizes. This one has two little uh, deals and it too was like under a dollar and then how many more items we got in here one two three maybe okay what's this oh the little fire starter sticks these things work pretty good I had bought some other ones yeah you can smell the fluid stuff on them but you just ruffle them up a little bit and they're they're like a twine soaked in not twine like you can peel them apart like that and um cut it and then just use a little bit of it to light to help start your fires um and this came with four and uh these may have been like a dollar 98 or something like that the other ones that I got are a little bit bigger than this. 
but I thought, you know, you can't really have too many of these, especially if you're out camping or, you know, put them in your bug out bag, whatever. And uh, have multiple ways to help you start a fire to keep warm, to keep dry, you know, just for safety. So there's that. What else I got? One, two, two more things. Dang, bummer. Okay, oh, okay. This is the other set of silverware. <sighs> Coming to the end of my bag already. <laughs> Come out of there. So yes, this is another set of silverware for um, Patrick's bag. Okay. These are just the coolest thing ever. I like these. I think he's going to like them too. Yep. Push it down over it. There's the fork. And then here's the spoon. E -e. The thing's got a little bit difficult to um, get over the, the thing, but I guess that's better than it folding up while you're eating. <laughs> ah. Okay. Here we go. So yeah, here you go. I love these. There you go. Fork, spoon, and a little butter knife. It's not, I mean, it's a little bit serrated. It might cut something, but it's not real, real sharp. But yeah, thought those were cool. Camping. It's the little things you forget about, you know. You'd be out camping or doing whatever and say, oh man. <laughs> we left so and so at the house. <laughs> so it's always little things, you know. Like I've got lighters in my bug out bag. And and um, we have uh, those little fire starter things. And the other little things. You can hang this on the outside of the bag. Backpack. Last item. Oh, it's another one of the face thingies. Well, dead gum. That was fast. See, it goes on your head. Should I put it on? <laughs> Let's do it. Let's see. I got a big head. So <laughs> oh. I mean, you can breathe through it good. <laughs> this part goes up over your ears. That's what it's extra protection over your ears. So, should I finish the video like this? <laughs> no, we'll take it off. <laughs> Ooh, that plays a little bit on my claustrophobia. <laughs> Especially when it's up over the nose. But hey, you know, when you're cold, you're cold. And every little layer helps. So, anyway, that was it to the new Timu haul. <laughs> um, favorite item? I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of got a few extra that um, I'm kind of liking. Um definitely my cup i do like my cup i'm gonna try it out this weekend and um see how it goes and then um add this stuff to my bag and yeah i got an extra christmas gift that i can put in somebody's bag and yeah i'm excited i'm pleased I'm definitely going to look into getting some more of those cups. Um, I, my entire family uses them. So, you know, it's a, it's a good deal to, um, to get. And, yeah. So, I hope that you guys... Um, oh, my hair come unclipped. <laughs> I 
hope that you guys have an awesome day and uh, awesome week and all that good stuff um, this weekend we're going to work on um, cleaning a mess up in the backyard just keeping it things tidy you know and um, yep <laughs> rearrange some of the chickadoos um, found a new way that I could record um, some of the chickies so I'm excited to give that a try and um, yeah I hope that you guys have a wonderfully blessed day and we will see you again real soon cheers <laughs>